In the previous two technical breakdowns, we examined how VRX predicts and prioritizes vulnerabilities. Now it's time to protect them. To understand how VRX's end-memory protection works, let's first review software structure. We'll use Firefox as an example. Every software is composed of three parts. Libraries, DLL files that contain sensitive functions, executables, exe files that run commands, and resources, text and image files that make everything look nice. When VRX is installed, it learns the components associated with each software, including which functions are sensitive and which applications are prone to attack. There are three attacks VRX defends against, process memory scraping, process impersonation, and direct API abuse. Let's start with process memory scraping. Here is Firefox EXE. When an executable is active, its memory space is vulnerable to attack. VRX creates a force field around the end memory process as defense. If an attacker virus.exe tries to inject itself into the memory space to steal a plain text password, it will be blocked or monitored depending on admin controls. Let's take a look at process impersonation. Impersonation attacks allow the hacker to carry out malicious activities under the disguise of Firefox.exe, including loading a library to call a sensitive function. But with VRX protecting Firefox.exe's memory space, such impersonation attempts are blocked. Finally, let's examine direct API abuse. Because VRX understands the software structure and which functions are sensitive, it knows which system calls to look out for. Let's say Firefox has a sensitive function inside the NSS3 library that's associated with encryption. When virus.exe loads the NSS3 library to its memory space, VRX immediately traces it. From here, the attacker will make a system call to this sensitive function, but it will be blocked by VRX's library protection. These defense mechanisms comprise VRX's proprietary patchless protection. Let's go protect those vulnerable assets. Here we are in the main dashboard. Let's explore our high-risk applications. We see that VRX has found several binary-level vulnerabilities on Firefox. Let's navigate over to Patchless Protection and take care of it. VRX found nine assets that are high-risk. Let's protect the top one. Now let's hover over the menu bar, click on Logs, and toggle over to the Event Log. We can filter for process memory abuse and voila! we see this virus tried to impersonate Firefox.exe. Let's now filter for unauthorized module abuse and, you guessed it, the attacker tried to abuse a sensitive function inside the NSS3 library. Not on VRX's watch. With patchless protection, security teams no longer have to wait for a patch. It's time to relax. VRX, Vulnerability Intelligence, In-Memory Protection. Start your free trial at vicarious.io slash sign slash up.